Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's me, Scott Dog. Welcome back to Inscription. Uh, we're still going through essentially the tutorial. We're on sort of map two. Uh, we got a choice. We can either choose cards uh, over here on the right hand side or over on the left hand side. Uh, from my memory of what these do, this just allows us to choose one of three cards. This one we allow, it allows us to choose the card power, and then we get to, to choose an animal from there. So we can um, we can choose a specific beast of a cost of one two or three uh, i think we'll go we've got a lot of twos i think we'll go th one the black goat okay um sacrificing it grants free blood so that's a step in the right direction with our requirement for four blood right we'll take you thank you the one thing i would say i'm concerned about is we don't do a lot of damage uh, we've got two items so we can only pick up another one another black goat powerful item that means he'll skip his turn let's take that uh, and we'll keep going. We've got a fight coming up. Okay, I really want to get you on the board and just see what you do. There's a bullfrog and there's a bee. Okay, let's squirrel. Let's black goat. You require one more. We can't get any more out just yet. Don't think we want to do anything else. Let's just continue. You're not going to do anything. These guys are going to come along and hit us and it's going to hurt quite a lot. But we're going to grab another squirrel. We're going to throw you out here. Then we're going to... And I guess we put you here. Now you're just going to do seven damage. I'm just going to put you straight there. I'm also going to get rid of this boulder, I think. Just for now. We probably didn't need to, but... We definitely didn't need to. I should have tried it first, right? I wasn't sure seven was enough. I could have looked. I'm an idiot. Okay. Stopped along, way, along the way by a trapper looking to liquidate their pelts. There was something uncanny about his appearance, but you were quickly distracted by his wares. Care to look at my pelts? Uh, the trapper dealt in teeth, the type collector from battle. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. So we can buy a wolf pet. Pelt. They're gained by dealing damage greater than what's needed to win. Uh, take a pelt free of charge. Lovely, thank you. See the quality? Yeah, it looks. I mean, it looks nice. Let's let's buy this one. Um, and I think we're done, right? I think we're done. Okay, how do we leave? Hello? You're leaving already? Please consider me pelts. No, I think we've got everything we can, mate. Thanks for your business. Love it. Thanks. They appear to be useless in a fight, but he mentioned the trader further down the pass. Okay, so we've got some pelts. It looks like they're going to clog up our, our deck, but we're, we're going to be able to do something with them eventually. Okay, what have we got going on here? We've got the fire, which makes things more powerful. We've got the bag, which would give us another item, or we've got the sacrifice stone. I think I'm going to go... I wonder, could we sacrifice onto the Urululi, uh, which will help us meaning we can sacrifice that every turn and it's going to stick around because it's got a lot of health but it's going to take forever to get out there let's go this way a group of survivors sorry starving survivors stood around a dying campfire uh, there's room for a creature on the fire one said near the fire one said the warmth will enhance its power said another one of your survivors said nothing sorry one of the survivors said nothing but could not stop licking their lips jeez okay so we can make something stronger what about the cat? We know we want the cat out there. If it ever gets into a place where to it, where it's going to attack, we don't really want it to. But... Hmm, what about the cat? What about the cat? What about the cat, though? Fine. Uh, the power of the cat was enhanced by the warmth. As the survivors began... One of the survivors began pulling a knife from their pocket. You withdrew. Giggity. Okay. Um, okay. We've got another battle. What's happening here? They're playing three cards down. A coyote, a kingfisher. This has got airborne. A card bearing the sigil strikes the opponent directly. It's got something else as well, right? Uh, waterborne. A card bearing the sigil submerges itself during the opponent's turn. While submerged, opposing creatures can only direct, directly attack the owner. Okay. So, I guess it makes sense to squirrel. Then I guess it makes sense to cat. We could do other things, but we don't want to. We are going to do one damage. 
and they're going to attack us for quite a lot. Ouchie. Then they're going to hide. Okay. So I think we squirrel. We put you down here. We then wolf, right? Sacrifice you, sacrifice you, wolf. Can't play you for now. Nice. Okay, so we can't do any damage to those things, but that means they can't do any damage to us. So it's important to stay alive. Let's squirrel and get our wolf cub down. Oh, we didn't need to. I'm an idiot. Because we're now doing a fair amount more damage than them, right, for now. Even than that back up, and then they're going to attack us for two again. But we're doing more damage than they are, especially now we've got a wolf cub. Let's pick you. There's a way out for both of us. It's somewhere in this foul cabin. Be silent or I will tear you to shreds. Thank you for that, mate. Okay. So we can play you by sacrificing our cat that doesn't go anywhere. Problem with the cat is you can't get rid of it. You need something to kill it. And I'm guessing at that point in time you don't want it killed when you're when you're doing these things. That should be enough, right? Got a few extra teeth. Love it. That was straightforward enough. What's this? You encountered a small outpost in the woods. Uh, tended by a mysterious woman. This was the trader the old trapper mentioned. Her appearance was unsettling, uh, but you were modified by her offerings. Oh, oh my lord. Uh, do you mind if I examine the pelts of yours? No, be my guest. Uh, let's start with your hair pelts. Here's what I can offer you. Uh, I can trade you any of these. Take your time so we could get a bear. This elk which moves after each attack. Um, a cat. We've already got one, so I don't know if we need another. The otter which ducks down. The moose buck is free. It's got free blood to get out. It's got hefty, which means it pushes everything over by one at the end of its turn. Uh, we can get the bullfrog, the mole, or the skunk. Whoops. What's happening here? This is my hand, right? I see. Okay, let's get the bear. It'd be difficult to get out, but I think... I think I like it. Okay, what have we got here? We've got the same cards, but this time they're a bit more a bit more exclusive, right? So the black goat has fly, which doesn't really help us. What's this? Rabbit hole. When a card bearing a sigil is played, a rabbit is created in your hand. A rabbit is defined as zero power, one health. Not convinced. I mean, that's going to help us get more things out, but this does no damage. Um... River Snapper with Flying Block. Is that what that is? Mighty Leap. I like the idea of that. The Addo with Flying. That doesn't help us at all, I don't think. The Skunk with... With... Um, reappearance after you kill it. The card bearing a sigil is sacrificed. It does not perish. So we can keep sacrificing it, but I don't know how that helps. This with Sacrifice is interesting. Let's take it. I feel like we're getting too many cards that are too expensive. But let's take it. Okay. I wonder if we could have not taken it and just moved on. Let's head over here. This is the sacrificing place, right? Let's see what we can do here. So we could sacrifice an adder, a cat, a wolf. A cat might not be the worst shout. What could we put it on? The stoat? The black goat? The grizzly? We want it on something that we can get out fairly early, right? Let's put it on you. So from what I remember, this keeps its original and gets another. So if we get the wolf early on, we can continue to throw that out. And, you know, as long as it doesn't die, we're in a good place. Okay, we didn't get the wolf cub, which is a bit disappointing. They're going to coyote kingfisher and kingfisher. You're going to stop that, so that's good news. So we just have to worry about these two. Let's squirrel. And then we stoat, right? It's not going to have enough to damage me or to kill me, so we should be good. Obviously, the problem with this is we can't get it out unless we've got a completely clear board. Uh, okay, let's continue. Okay, so the good news is over here is that you're going to kill this and do damage to this, right? Not enough, but you're going to hit it. At the very least. I guess we want to be doing damage over there. We could... It's 
So we don't have enough to help out over here, right? What do we do right now? You're going to kill him. And you'll do one damage up here. But then these things, are they doing one damage each? I think so. We're going to do one damage to us. So let's squirrel for now. That's all I'm going to do. I forgot this. They're all going to do damage, right? So two damage. Ouchie. Okay. Um, let's squirrel again and put you down here. But then let's not sacrifice. We want to sacrifice, right? Sacrifice you. Sacrifice you. Put you down. You're going to do damage here and kill both of these. You're going to attack over here. We should be in a much better place, I think. That feels a lot, a lot happier. And then we've got room to put something down here. Now that's been destroyed. Uh, we can't put you down, so I guess we really need a wolf cub. We didn't get it. We did get a black goat, which is nice. Okay, so we're going to put... We're going to... No, we're going to... That doesn't work. Well, it does. Let's put you down here for a couple of sacrifices, all right? And we'll put you here, and then we will play you by sacrificing you and you and putting you down here, and we should do big damage. And that gives us extra teeth. I love it. Okay. Good for the kill shot, that thing. I'm not sure how much use it is for anything else. Okay, we get to choose another card. A mole. Only present mole. It burrows itself and emerges to block a landborn attacker. That could be useful. Uh, the bullfrog, we've seen before. The mantis. Fervid mantis is praying. Uh, prying claws strike both to the left and the right. We'll take the mantis. I quite like the idea of that. You could put it behind a boulder and it could attack either way, right? Uh, we could go to items or sacrifices. Let's do that. I wonder, could we sacrifice the mantis for something else that's going to do more damage? We can. Interesting. What about on you? That would be huge, right? Or the adder. The adder would be interesting, right? Let's do that. We don't see the adder very often, but I like the idea that you're able to kill two things at once. That's pretty sweet. Okay, what is this? That's not ideal, is it? My boss battles are high stakes. Okay. With one flame, you will either overcome them or die. Fear not, I will let you keep the smoke. Okay. Thanks for that. A foul smell invaded your nostrils and caused your throat to seize. A hulking man sat at the brackish pond with his feet submerged in the dark water. He pulled a hook from the pile of rotting fish and rose to his feet. I am the angler. Go fish. What the heck? So you're going to play a kingfisher. We've got a smoke. Don't know what that does. Well, it doesn't do anything from the looks of things. I'm guessing we can, we can't sacrifice it. I don't. I don't. I'm guessing we can't sacrifice it. That would be silly. We can play a squirrel. We can play a black goat, and then we could get our adder or our river snapper out. The adder seems like the better option right now. Okay, so we squirrel. We go. We adder. Okay, so we're doing two damage already. Do we throw the smoke out? I don't know why we would. I don't know what it does. There's two damage. I like it. Kingfish is in and going to do one damage back. Um, which fish are choose? What's this? What's this shit? What does that mean? Okay, so I think we... You know what? We can play a squirrel. This this works, I think. We play a squirrel. I think we have to sacrifice it. Something's going to happen to this, right? So I think we... Oh, okay. Interesting. He's now going after that rather than this. I'm guessing if we play you, the same's going to happen, right? I can only assume that they're going to pull this into their half. Which is fine. I don't mind the squirrel being there, actually. Let's play the smoke there instead. New fish. Okay, so you're going to do that. We can then... No, because then you're going to do this. Every time we do this, they're going to they're going to steal whatever we play last. So let's do this. Should have played it the other way around. Two damage. They're going to do two damage back. Now the smoke is there. We should be good, right? Okay, what have we got? We've got River Snapper. Um... 
And what have we got on the board? A squirrel already. Let's take you. We want something that does more damage, right? That's not going to be enough. I mean, we could sacrifice you two, but we're already doing two damage to their one. So maybe not the worst. We could get them to wait their turn. I'll pass my next turn. Thanks, me. Appreciate it. I think we end turn here, right? I don't think we want to sacrifice the adder for now. Because he's doing two damage every turn. I'm uh, obligated to pass. Yeah, we know. Okay. So we want a squirrel. That we want to throw down here. And then... I guess we... This is only doing one damage. Whereas if we took everything off the board, this would do three damage. I think we're going to do that, you know. Because we can also sacrifice this every time. Let's put it here. Oh, it's going to move every turn as well. Interesting. We'll see how well or badly that goes. There's three damage. So that should be enough to kill them once. Nice. And er everything... Oh my god. Too fast, too soon. What the hell is this? What? Card bearing the signal will be... What the hell is this crap? I should have waited for the pause, right? Okay, so the good news is we can at least get you out with a sacrifice of these two, which means you're going to do damage to this, but it might not be enough, right? The might the moose cannot be halted. Ow, 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 ow. Gee, what was that all about? What the hell are we supposed to do there? Oh my god. Ugh. What the hell was that? There's no way you can win that, right? I guess if you had like a boulder, had the pause turn, they might all have helped. But even then, you wouldn't have been able to get enough cards out to, to do enough damage just yet. You aren't dead. This isn't purgatory, uh, though you may think of it that way. Before you expire, I must ask a favor. I would like a memento. Okay, your very own death card. It's quite plain at the moment, isn't it? We will work together to amend that. I wanted to be the perfect memento of you. Here are some cards from your mediocre deck. We can put them to good use. Choose a card to draw the cost from. Okay, we'll take the river snapper. Two, two blood. It's going to cost us to play this. Okay. Another will use the power and health. Well, that makes the most sense, right? Amazing. That's the reason we picked this up. Surely. Uh, and now, uh, choose a card which will extract sigils. So this would give us extra blood, but this one is poison. Whatever it hits, it kills, and it attacks in two directions. It's got to be this, right? I never did ask your name. Okay, we can we can enter that. Don't worry. It's got dog, obviously. There is now but one final matter, the portrait. Are you ready? You don't need to smile. I was actually smiling. Okay. Oh, my God. That's bright. I'm playing in a dark room. That's bright. Okay. I like it. I like... I like that that was a thing. I don't know what kind of thing that was, but I like it. Here we go again. Another challenger. It would be interesting to know if we have to go... Uh, perhaps you can understand bones. There's more... It'd be interesting to know if we start at the very beginning or what. A reforceful opossum costs two bones. Okay. You can gain a bone when one of your creatures perishes for any reason. Okay, so every time we kill, sacrifice something, that, that dies. That's interesting. That rattler doesn't do anything. We've got a squirrel. I wonder if we've got that other card in our hand. Uh, you're going to do free damage. So we've got nothing that we can use to stop that. So let's, let's get the stoat out, right? From the death of your creature, you gained a bone. You will not lose this until it was spent. Okay. So we could squirrel and a possum. You're only going to stop that from attacking, mind you. What about you? You die to this thing when it comes out. I think we wait a turn. I don't know that they come onto the board and immediately hit you. It annoys me. Okay, let's, um, let's have a think about this. Let's squirrel. Let's 
Squirrel over here. Then we want a wolf, right? Was I asleep again? Oh, man. And now we can also play you, right? So you should kill this thing. You should kill this thing. We should get a point back. They're going to come and kill our wolf. I don't like it. Uh, I guess we take a squirrel and we just throw you down here. Hopefully we do enough damage to... Ooh. Ouchie. Okay, but we should have enough. Whatever this is. A bullfrog. Not, I mean, not great. Not great. I'll grant you. We want a bullfrog for squirrel, right? That should be enough. Nice. No extra, no extra teeth or anything. That should be enough. So it looks like we do start at the very beginning. Oh. I forgot your figurine. Get up and fetch it for me. All right. You can get it yourself, you lazy. It's beside the safe. Okay, I hear you. Mighty Leap card. Better. So this is the... Oh, so I see. So this is the instruction manual, right? Or the, the, the manual. What the hell? Okay, there's a, there's a lot over going on over there. What's this? Bullfrog and squirrel. What are these? I mean, this seems unlikely, right? Okay. There's the figurines that we need. We haven't got anything to put in over here. I guess we just pick up the figurine and... Hold on, there's something in that thing. I don't like it. Let us continue. Okay. I hear you. Let's go and pick a card. I feel like saving those items to like the boss fights is very, very important. Unkillable cockroach returns to your hand after dying. It costs bones. And a furious rattler, a bris uh, bristle creature, uh, once passed his monstrous... A brittle creature once passed his monstrous fangs. Coyote, a mega creature. Uh, but what do you expect for only four bones? Um... I feel like we're always going to have bones, right? Because we're always going to be sacrificing. I just don't know if we're ever going to get to the numbers for these. Um, let's go Rattler. I feel like saving up and getting one thing out that does damage is better than better than waiting. Keep uh, Okay, we keep moving. We've already got a couple of items, I think. Uh, some bones for a rainy night or a boulder. Let's take the bones. I like this in a little piggy bank. Uh, okay. Are you smart or something? He usually doesn't even bother teaching about bones. Okay. All right. Here's a tip. I saw a past victim writing a passcode in the rule book. Okay. Well, we know where the rule book is. What's going on? There's a wolf cub. What have we got? A wolf, a squirrel, a stoat. I guess we... I guess we squirrel and then we stoat, right? Over here. Because that will kill the the wolf for sure. What the hell is an alpha? Uh, let's take a squirrel. What's this? Leader. Creatures adjacent to this card bearing a signal gain one power. Well, you're going to be dead next time. You do one damage. I'm going to squirrel over here. I can't get anything else out, so I'm going to hold on. You're going to come and attack us. That's fine. Uh, we can now pick you up. A bullfrog, but we can more importantly... Oh, we should have got another squirrel. I'm an idiot. Okay, well, let's play you down here. I, could, I mean, I could kill these two things and get the wolf out, but I don't I don't necessarily want to. Our bullfrog is going to stay alive. You're going to come over here. We can sacrifice you now and you for you. You're not putting any more cards down. Okay, what else have we got? How many bones have we got? Not enough. Let's get another squirrel. Let's throw a squirrel down. One, two, three, four, five. Not enough. But we should do enough for a teeth, right? Nice. And that's what matters. Okay. If you desire it, you may stand now. It will allow me time to plan. Well, we know we need to look at the rule book again, right? Do keep your hands off my possessions. Okay, I can do that. Sort of. Oh, God. How do I stand up? Rule book. 273. That's got to be the safe, right? Interesting. 
Interesting. The stink bug. Oh, hello. I wasn't sure if I would ever escape the iron crypt. It's... Is the stoat around? The stunted wolf? The madness, this madness must end. Okay, we got key. Okay, we got key, everybody. Can only open this, and I guess we'll open it next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter at Scuttle Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you have been watching Scott Dog Gaming. Don't forget to follow on Twitch and Twitter and head over to YouTube for daily content. See you again soon.